Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're back playing Magicraft. So yeah, Magicraft actually got a pretty big update. Uh, none of which I can show off here yet. We actually have to get into the adventure before I can actually show off any uh, of that stuff. But, so we'll kind of see, uh, there's some mutated monsters and some pretty crazy stuff that was added. So. Hopefully we can, we'll be able to, we'll get to see that stuff, but obviously no guarantee, but crossing my fingers hoping for the best. Right off the bat, getting the troll serum, which is actually pretty good, because obviously we have the summoner build, so that's going to be a nice start to this. Okay, let's see, what kind of rebound, pillar of light, I guess we should go for that one. Not really what I would call, you know, necessary stuff at the moment, but it's fine. Go for more spells. Spells are always pretty much better than anything else. So far, not really noticing any differences, I don't think, other than these things flying around, which is a little different. I don't remember them doing that. Okay, I guess, in that sense, that's definitely a little different than usual. Um, okay. So yeah, like I said, there's like mutated monsters, so hopefully we'll be able to get to see those guys. Not sure, because some of them were saying like night, it's like nightmare stuff. So I'm not sure if it's all just, it's only nightmare um, difficulty things. Because the nightmare difficulty is obviously, it's above hard. So you have to beat hard mode and then you unlock nightmare. Um, oh. Whoa, okay, this, these guys are new. This, this guy here isn't, but these guys right here, they are definitely new. These exploding, like, rock monsters. Interesting, okay. Yeah, I've never seen those guys before, okay. Well, okay, so I, I guess that, that's it then, uh... That means that we should see start seeing some monsters eventually. Obviously, there's so many of them in the game that we're not. A, it's still not a guarantee that we're gonna see like mutated monsters. But I think they also added some new like bosses and stuff as well. Um. Okay, this elite is normal. But again, I think that they might have some new stuff. Uh, maybe not like a new event. But... Okay, nice. We didn't need to go no damage with that, but... One choice, three energy for every spell cast. Honestly, I don't really like any of these. Um, but it does have more slots, and I do want to go with that. So I'm gonna just do that anyways. So it does. So because then they'll get a damage increase, they'll get more health, and um, I guess we could. Just for the sake of having it be like that. Oh yeah, those guys look different as well. I guess I didn't realize that. I don't know if, if we've seen them before, but if we have, I ha I didn't realize it. Yeah, they're like the nails or whatever on top of them are a little bit elongated, a little bit taller than usual. Yeah, the featherweight one, it does have a faster regeneration rate, it's just that the max mana is a little, it's, it's 
half of the other Damn, yeah, these guys are, they're holding their own. They usually do pretty well at that. Probably just going to go for a relic room here. And then we can summon these guys to go out and fight. Oh yeah, spells can penetrate walls, that's right, I forgot I had gotten that. So that's actually gonna be crazy good for this. Uh, I'm gonna go with that, uh, just to increase my chance of getting that Scarlet Room. Okay, so these two, that two, those two, and then those two. Okay, I got it. And, okay. And that's pretty bad. Um... It's fine. Honestly, I feel like this. I feel like playing this game is like helping with my memory. Uh, <laughs> I'm honestly, probably gonna go with that and then just reforge everything else. I don't really want any of the other things. Um, I'll go with that. Put a little bit more damage on my Ember Heart. Yeah, it definitely seems like, yeah, these guys are definitely different. Um, not something that I've seen before. I mean, I've seen them before, but I don't remember them ever being able to just go out and attack. I thought they always had to be, like, circling around enemies. But no, these they they can just, like, go out on their own and attack you. So, I, I feel like that is a new thing, but maybe I'm just... Maybe I've just never noticed it before. I, I have no idea. Oh, these snakes, leave me alone. I hate fighting the snake. I like, they just, they're just creepy. I just find them extremely creepy. Like, that's... They aren't, like, that difficult to deal with or anything like that. I just find them extremely creepy. What is this potion? with that. Ooh, six points. That'll be really good, actually. Okay, hopefully we get a good boss. Like, one that isn't... <sighs> this guy. This is not the one that I was wanting. This is actually my least favorite one. Fight. Especially early on. I would prefer the spider egg thing that shoots the poison out. Because this guy's really hard to dodge. If you have a fast attack or a fast movement speed, then he's probably like not that bad, but Oh, okay. Please, 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 okay. Didn't take any damage there, okay. Got the Scarlet Room. Luckily. Okay. 
Um, that actually would be pretty good. I mean, there's a lot of slots. Cooldown, don't really care for it. Um, can go for damage. Go for that. Spell flight speed. And then I guess we could... Uh, we'll have... Uh, what's up? Uh, cooldown doesn't really matter. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Okay, we have a good amount of HP. Not as much as I would like to have, though. I would actually like all of these things. Um... Dang. Plus one slot per one. I think I will go for that. I'm gonna go for that. Oh, it's because yeah, I forgot my movement speed just increased by a ton. By 40%. I forgot about that. I was like, why am I moving so fast? <laughs> Oh, but the scatter is crazy. <laughs> well, whenever you guys feel like actually hitting him, just let me know. Um... <laughs> Look at this. this is Yeah, I mean, I guess this is one downside of this whole thing. Is... The sc their scatter is, uh, pretty crazy. Um, I'll do a quick reforge, see what we get. Um, honestly, not terrible. No, I do want to keep that. This isn't too bad. Uh, increase all of my damage. Go with this so then we can open this thing and then we got our key back. Nice. No! Okay, I didn't even realize that hole was right there, and then I just took some damage. Oh, okay. This movement speed is a little hard to control. Um, I wish the camera was a little bit better at following, but I think it's fine. Uh, let's go with that, actually. I think that'll be nice. Okay, we got a coin. Nice. Definitely want an HP boost. 100% need that. Yeah, that scatter. I mean, the scatter isn't gonna be too bad. Um, obviously, there's ways around getting around the scatter, so I'm not like 
I'm definitely not gonna sit here and be like, oh yeah, the, I wish I would have gotten a different one. No, this is definitely a lot better than some of the other things I could have gotten. A diamond transform into coins. Sure, honestly, yeah. Things just got darker. It's not like it's not that big of a deal, right? And really, the only time that like um, the only time I'm gonna really notice the all diamonds transform into coins. The only time I'm really gonna notice that is when like if I go for a coin room so it's like as long as I don't go for a coin room I'm not gonna really notice it to be careful because I'm getting a little complacent with my movement because for whatever reason I constantly feel like I feel like instead of me moving fast I'm like I'm starting to feel like I'm flying because of, because of the speed at which I am traveling um so I feel like I'm flying so then I get a little complacent and start you know wanting to just fly over gaps or whatever and obviously, like, I can't do that. I'm not actually flying. So that's... So I am getting a little complacent with, with some of my movements. So I do need to be a little careful. Would have been nice if I could have gotten a key there, but... I think I did. I don't see one around. I mean, at the, with the speed at which I'm traveling, I honestly am not that worried about this guy. Because, like, if he starts moving towards me, I can just travel to, like, the other side of the arena and just basically avoid him. And he's dead. Didn't even take any damage. Nice. Definitely would like another HP boost, though. I'll grab both of those. What is, uh... that 24 out of 50? Okay. Am I not gaining any HP for entering... Aren't I supposed to gain HP for entering rooms, or is that only if I'm down HP? Maybe that's only if I'm down HP, but still, I would, I don't know. I'm a little, I'm a little confused, but that might just be me being stupid. It oftentimes is. <laughs> That guy takes quite a while to beat when you guys cannot shoot in a straight line. Oh my 
my gosh, there's more enemies. Jeez. Okay. Let's go with that. Honestly, yeah, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just take the road. I could get rid of another curse, but that costs more HP than I'm really willing to sacrifice at the moment. And I don't think the curses I currently have are really that big of a deal. So it's, um, oh, but it's, uh, this thing that's feeding into the seed of greed. Okay, that makes sense. I was wondering, like, where is this plus one HP always coming from? And it's, it's from that thing. That makes sense. Okay. Yeah, they're scattered. I mean, again, the wand is still, like, definitely better. But I just wish I could get some stuff that would make the scatter a little bit less annoying to do with. Just use this potion. Add another one, anyways. Okay. I upgraded that one. Okay, that's not too bad. Simultaneous firing. Not a big fan of any of those. Um, sure. Why not? Not bad. Oh, force cooldown is is gone from. Um, wait, this got zero. Well, that's that's huge. Um, oh, it's because of the because of the black mark. That's right. Um, I lost my turn of thought. Okay. Um. I'll get back on to, I'll get back into my train of thought in just a second. Um. So the increase is minus five. Okay, that's lovely. Reforge that. We got another pop, which is really nice. But yeah, that's gone from, uh, that's down from 70% to 60%, so that's actually going to be a faster cooldown now. Um, for that... Honestly, I might switch it to this. I don't know how I didn't realize that it was switched, but I indeed did not. I'll probably go with that, though. I'm getting a random treasure chest. I like it. Remote control. Ooh, okay. That's a good one as well. Got another one. Okay. No, let's keep that. 
Those guys I can reforge. See if I can get something better. Um, arguably, uh, it's 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 a bit iffy. Okay, the hover thing is not that big of a deal. Black hole might be better. Let's get the keys though. I want that. Probably want that. Cover again, don't really need it. Yeah, let's get rid of my curses. This is pretty, it's actually going pretty well, I would say. Obviously it could be better, but definitely not going bad by any. Oh, uh, okay, okay. That's a little scary. Whoa, okay, that guy is new. Yeah, that, the big guy. I've seen these guys before, obviously, but that big guy I've never seen before. He's definitely new. Okay, let's When they say mutated monsters, I wonder if they really do just mean, like, the monsters are, like, basically the same, but just... Uh, like bigger, probably have more health, and a little bit harder to deal with. That's kind of what I'm thinking that they're just referring to. When they're saying that they like mutated monsters, which I mean, fair enough. I mean, that would be that that is going to be difficult to deal with. Like I could, if I could fly, I could get to this chest. Oh wait, I can just get to the chest anyways. Never. I really thought that I was not going to be able to get around that, but apparently, uh, apparently I'm not as fat as I thought I would be. This game must have been made in a different country. Definitely not an American character. Um, grab that. That freeze is actually really coming in handy. Well, it's not my favorite. I definitely would prefer better things and other, you know, other things that would be better, but it's not, it's not terrible. Do 
Steven did a pretty good job at taking them out. Um, I'm surprised how quickly he, uh, he died. Uh, I actually am quite surprised. Definitely where I'm gonna be a little concerned with how this is gonna go. Because definitely white There are obviously a few strategies that I have, but then again, I guess it doesn't really matter if I take damage. I mean, it matters if I take damage that, like, make sure I don't lose, but other than losing, yeah, if I want to get the Scarlet Room, I can still get the Scarlet Room even if I can take damage if I have. The Relic that allows me to still get the Scarlet Room even if I do take damage, so it's not like the end of the world. I'm just kind of trying to figure out what is going to be better. What is the best? Um, because obviously I need damage. I need damage right now. I'm honestly kind of, I don't think that's going to be bad. I, I, I don't know if switching the pop out for the skull to blue is really the best, best bet. Um, I mean, we could do it, I guess. I mean, and my movement is fine. Like, I'm, I'm not too worried about taking damage. It really is just my damage. I just don't have enough damage. Like, I can, I can, I can out run his lasers. I just... I just want this to, this fight to be over. <laughs> the only thing I can't... I mean, I can help maneuver him as well, but it definitely is a little bit more of a... a bit more of a struggle. An unknown factor. When he's laser as well is a little difficult. You don't know which way you can trap. Then I guess I guess it doesn't really matter. Like I said, I have the relic that lets me have access to the Scarlet Room. Kind of overreacting when it comes to using my potions. Oh my gosh. That's an annoying spot to get stuck at. I 
there's, there's always a specific spell that I want to get. Ever, ever since I got it once, I'm like, I need to get it again. Um, don't remember what exactly the name of it is. I, I need to, I need to start remembering. Oh, energized orb is always good. I have an idea. This is really good. Silver key is just better. And we'll be able to keep some of my health as well. I think I'm happier with that seven. Yeah, it doesn't matter. that or making that. I don't think that really does anything. At least not in this situation. So There's gotta be a better strategy, I just don't know what, like, there's gotta be like a combination of spells that I currently have, but, oh yeah, and then they redid this one, so there's a 25% chance of auto-casting when using other wands, and a 20% chance of not consuming MP when using auto-cast, which I think is pretty cool. I do like that that has that. Um, get rid of. I don't know what that upgraded. These fangs? No, it upgraded my Emperor Heart, I think. Kinda what it seems like. They're not even like that difficult, uh, especially like with my movement speed. Like my movement speed is actually crazy strong. Like I didn't realize how good it was gonna be to have this fast of a movement speed. But it's 
way better than I thought it was going to be. Stand still. <laughs> Let them do all the work. I would like the the um, traction thing. I would absolutely love to get that spell. So then the scatter thing is not that big of a deal when it comes to these guys. It's gonna be a little bit easier to deal with, but eh, I guess it's fine the way it is. Fuse can get rid of that. Get rid of that. Okay, this is a time where I'm going to use this potion. So I don't even have to worry about taking damage. And just use this potion. And completely avoid all of it. You guys might say it's a waste, but... Look at all the shurikens flying out. Yeah, and actually, you know what, looking at what I just got from it, yeah, it is kind of a, a waste. I love a little bit more luck when it comes to stuff, stuff I get. I would like a little bit more luck, please. I don't want to keep just getting garbage. Yeah, I guess this potion's kind of useless. Just just thinking about it. Don't really have a point, uh, have a use for that potion. Because it's not like I need to unlock anything anyways, like... Any, if I ever need to unlock something, I can just use it because I have the silver key. Yeah, my damage with this build has is has been absolutely horrendous. Like I I my movement speed is really fast, everything is going good, but my my damage is just horrible. Like I do not have enough movement speed at all. I'm gonna try to go into this process room and see if I can get something hopefully better. What does this go up to? Okay, and then so I'll have another slot available for if I want to put something there. Um, Oh, and MP regen of the wand went up from 40% to 50%. Okay, 
Okay, nice. Okay, what? Oh, I got a pillar of light? Okay. Dude, these guys are big now. Uh, what happens if I do that? So the size of the projectile has just, has just become bigger. Okay. I mean, fair enough. Kind of what I was expecting. Get rid of my last curse. Don't even remember what it was. Whatever it was, it was probably really annoying. actually such a bad setup. Like, I need a shop. I honestly need a shop. The shop is the only thing that might give me what I want right now. Because, yeah, honestly, for the time being, it's just not... Uh, this is not... This is not... I need... I need something better. That guy look, looks different. Um, seems like he does the same thing though as, as these guys, but... It looked a little different. Maybe, maybe they don't really do much different. Maybe they just look different. Maybe it's more of like a visual difference. I have no idea. Actually, that guy had red eyes. That was a pretty big difference. Also seemed like he was moving faster, like he was like charging at me. Maybe it's just me that saw that. But... Yeah, see, look at that. He's like charges at me. That does seem different. Again, I could be completely delus delusional, but... That could just be a normal part of that enemy, but it really... I don't... I don't feel like it is. Well, I mean, th I guess they could have changed it, actually. It now might be a normal part of that enemy because of the changes and stuff that they made. So I guess there is also that potential. Oh, okay, you annoying little freaking thing. I wasn't expecting if there to be freaking three of them. I saw one, then I saw two, and then I didn't, before I even knew it, there was a third one that was like, right by me, trying to grab me. Jeez. Jeez. Move 
movement speed is hard to control. I'm going to blame it on the movement speed and not me being completely incompetent. Okay, this guy is going to be quite the challenge. Because movement speed does kind of play a role against this guy. Um, but it's honestly more just maneuverability. Like, knowing how to, uh, like, where to move at the right time. Yeah, just like, it's mainly like, just knowing when to move, not really how fast you move. You could move really slow and still be really, pretty much be fine against this guy. Because you just have to time, time your movement right. I cannot really do. Oh my gosh, yeah. Especially with that purple triangle thing, it's so difficult. Because you have to be looking on both sides of the screen basically at the same time, and it's quite literally impossible for me to do that with the monitor that I have. Um, anyways, let's just upgrade that a little bit, I think. Anyways. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Magicraft. If you did, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. To me, the world to me doesn't cost you guys anything. And yeah, hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.